Hey, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you an absolutely simple and fantastic recipe for a baked porgy stuffed with herbs on a bed of peppers and onions all baked in the oven. It has come to my attention that I don't make enough videos on fish or seafood. Well, today that's about to change. And for this recipe, I am using four beautiful salt water um, porgies, what we affectionately call in Greece tibudas. So to start us off, what you're gonna do is take your uh, fish, your porgies, and you're gonna have your fishmonger or whoever you get your fish from, clean them, scale them, all that kind of stuff. And from here, what we're gonna do is you're gonna take your knife and very easily just cut scores down the one side. Not, doesn't have to be anything fancy, just three scores, just like that. And you're gonna do this to all four of them or as many fish as you're working on. Now the next part of this recipe is very simple. What you're gonna do is just take a little bit of your Greek extra virgin olive oil and maybe a tablespoon or two just on the bottom of your pan, just like that, and leave that off to the side because what's gonna happen next is we're gonna cut up our veggies, our onions and our peppers. Now for this recipe here, I'm using two onions, uh, decent sized onions, and about three or four red peppers, depending on the peppers you have. And I'm just gonna take my onions and just throw them in my pan. I'm gonna take my red peppers and just slice them up into rings, basically. That's perfect right there. A little salt, a little pepper, and just mix these all about. And you go, what you're gonna do is just put them as an even layer at the bottom of your pan. And what's gonna happen is your fish are gonna rest on these and create almost like a moisture bed for your porgies uh, to rest on. I will tell you that for this recipe as well, you could also use sea bass, you can use red snapper, um, mackerels will work well for this as well. Now I'm gonna place my porgies back into my pan and super easy just like this and this is where we start dolling our fish up like most things we have to season and it makes me nuts when people don't season their fish on the inside and what they do is they just put something on the outside a little bit of salt and pepper and they think that's fine well it really isn't because a lot of the meat you're going to be eating is below the surface of the skin and that's where you want to season uh, the most. So a little salt and pepper goes in here. We're going to take a little bit of parsley, a few sprigs, stuff them in each cavity of the fish. These are going to provide us with some really cool, really beautiful aromatics and it's exactly what's going to add to the flavor of our fish. The next thing we're going to use is lemons. And you're gonna to wanna to cut your lemons about a quarter of an inch thick. What we're gonna do is, you're gonna take one of these lemons and stick them in the belly of the fish. The next thing, a little more. Salt on the top. Perfect, just like that. A little bit of pepper as well. Nothing complicated. Now, Going back to those slats that we made in the fish or the slices, you're gonna take your lemons and you're gonna place them inside the slats. The next part of this is, of course, a little bit of Greek extra virgin olive oil. Just drizzle on your fish, just like that. Nothing complicated. We're gonna take a few sprigs of fresh oregano and just throw them liberally around the fish and this will give you such a beautiful flavor. If you can find fresh oregano, use it, especially this time of year, it's everywhere. That's perfect, just like that, like a picture. And now 
The next part of this is we're gonna grab some aluminum foil and I'm just gonna cover this pan up and we're gonna throw this in our 400 degree oven for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, what we're gonna do is take off the foil and put it in for another 20 to 30 minutes depending on how brown you want your fish. Now we're not trying to seal anything in, we just want to deflect the heat so the fish cooks from the inside as well. 